Hello ladies and gentlemen, we are back with our third installation to the Saints Row Let's Play. And uh, last episode, you know what, let's just cut it. Let's just look at our powers and uh, see what we can do. Alright, two new powers. Buy both powers, I can do that. Super Sprint. Run faster than cars. Alright. Super Jump. Planetary. Okay. Well, oh, this all right. feels brilliant. Here, let me load up a training program for you to test your powers. Where am I going? What's happening? So, oh, okay. The code says you can jump long distances and run at super high speeds. How about starting with a small jump? Oh shit. Okay, try focusing on charging oh, your jump. Spider Man? That should get you higher. How exactly am I supposed to jump up that? Try pushing off from the wall each jump. So I just run up walls now, do I? It'd be more I'm definitely to jump up them repeatedly. Pretty much the same thing. I'm just a lot better looking. Crikey! This oh, well, there's my super sprint. Try making that jump. Oh, I'm liking this! Okay, this now is pretty badass. It's kind of like a uh, crackdown meets Saints Row. Be Just try it. Oh, I did it without knowing I was supposed to do that. Do right. Good. Look at my legs. Jesus Christ. Spot on. See? You did it! Da 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 da. Gotta hurt while wearing heels. This is already pretty ridiculous. How many how much more ridiculous can this get? Every time you hit a checkpoint, you'll be able to stay in the program a bit longer so you can reach the end. Though you probably want to avoid the firewalls along the way. Good luck. I kind of like the little cyber races in Saints Row 3. We're going for gold, even though we're probably not gonna get it. How's this race tied to the simulation? Don't know, but it seems like when you break through any checkpoints along the race, the district reality matrix will overload a little. You lost me. <sighs> it means the simulation doesn't like it. Uh, and we're do we even avoid the cars anymore? Hey, that time it made sense. It's the first time we said it to you. Guess not. Love you too, Kitty. Lies. I'm still gonna ride my perfect pink tricycle motorcycle thing. We got silver. That was ridiculous. I didn't even see the other ones. I must be blind. Or stupid. Or both. We have two quests. Uh, we get a somehow a shotgun for this. Explore the tower. Oh wow, there's data things everywhere now. Jumpability for my personal records. 
much more ridiculous. Another thing, uh, I was going to get some better audio for this. Uh, people are saying the audio isn't that bad, but it bothers me. And I wanted to get something a little bit better, but I'm going to have to wait until probably tomorrow. So no big deal, but still, like I said, it just bothers me. Am I going to scale the top of that? So. Warp point. Alright. Ah, oh, God, I saw it. Oh, yeah! The animation for running up the walls or jumping up the walls is kind of derpy. Uh, for a while, I felt like I was just kind of playing a, a remake of Saints Row 3 whenever I got back to Steelport. But I don't know, this is already pretty cool. I'm already kind of liking this. There's clusters all up this entire thing. Are there more than just this one? Pretty cool. Right at the top. Nope, another warp point. Nineteen clusters. Yeah! Twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. 22, 23, 24, 25. I really don't know what other games to play than just Saints Row 4 and Dark Souls, so if anyone could get uh, some input on that. I have a lot of games, obviously, I don't... Yeah, this headset that I have kind of conks out whenever I'm talking mid-sentence, so that's also why I would like to get a new one. It's nothing special, it's just a little ring of ink. Oh wow, I just changed the completely color. I don't know how I did that, but apparently I knew how to do that. Yeah, there's a little rinky dink, uh, $20 microphone from Walmart. probably upgrade myself, but I'm gonna wait. I can do more of my powers now. Yeah, I'll increase speed. Air dash and jump height. Let's get jump height first. Now the air dash. Now we got jump glide and jump height 2. Interesting. Simulated fraud, alright. Yeah, is that gonna hurt me? Guess not. No big deal, just uh really unattractive man, lady, hooker. I, I still don't know what I am. Can someone give me some little, like, idea of what the hell I am? I already know that I'm really sexy, but besides that... I still have like the game of cat and mouse for whenever you're playing multiplayer with friends. So I mean if so. Actually this game sounds really fun, I can't even get up there. But anyway, this, this uh, game sounds really fun to do on multiplayer. 
chasing your friends around like this and having them fly around? Because I assume we're going to be able to fly soon. Because, I mean, if we can glide and jump high and super sprint and all that, I mean, if we couldn't fly, that'd be kind of silly. At the same time, kind of negates uh, cars and airborne sh shit in general. But at the same time, I'm sure people will still like to use them, or whatever, just for the fact of using them. I've never really cared that much for cars or anything like that. I've always just wished I could kind of run around. So I'm enjoying this quite a lot. Looks like I can land on that. Oh, nope. Alrighty, we're almost there. Oh wow, uh, I completely just missed that. This game actually kind of snuck up on me. I didn't realize that it came out whenever it did come out. I got like probably the day after, because I saw my friends playing and I was like, oh, it's out already? Slow on that. Oh, yeah. Oh. For some reason I feel like whenever I would run into that it would kill me, but I guess not. That's for other games to get, I haven't really decided. I mean I want to get uh, Metal Gear Solid 5 for sure. Got that sorted now. And of course, Dark Souls 2. I the rag on myself. You really think this doesn't hurt? So do I just keep on using Super Sprint and I can just do this? When does it stop hurting? Hi guys. Don't mind me just being really sexy. Holy shit! <laughs> Don't mind me, guys. That's supposed to happen. Or am I just breaking the game? I don't have any words right now. I need to do that again. Hold on. My plant needs me! Mom, I'm home. I'm, I'm having too much fun with this. I may actually fail because I'm just having too much fun with this. Hey, car. kind of fun, except for that uh, one where you were like on the back of a four-wheeler and you had to throw like cocktails, I figure with a partner there to throw cocktails. All those cocktails, I don't know why, just like the expert difficulty one was just kind of annoying. What happened if I just... Landings are awful! Making my way downtown, walking fast, pace is fast, I'm home now. I don't even know if I'm the lyrics right, to be honest. Holy 
shit. <laughs> I'm probably gonna fail this. Gotta step into overdrive. It's my heart. And yeah, you've been higher than this. No, I'm gonna fail. Alright, here we go. What I say yes. Come on, so close. Are you kidding me? <laughs> almost, almost. Got you now. Yeah, I think uh, at least, yeah, this will definitely make it. I'm gonna keep on going though, because I can. Run into some of these people. Hi guys, how you doing? Yeah, I guess I did, so I mean... I have a lot of fun with that, actually. I'm gonna probably do more of those. I know I sound extremely enthusiastic, but that's just my awkwardness setting in. Also because I have to talk louder with this headset, so hopefully when I get some better audio choices, then I'll, of course, do this more. I won't feel so awkward. But I definitely do appreciate all of my friends that watch this, whether they watch it out of pity or they watch it out of actual enjoyment, which I don't know why they would. But either way, I really do appreciate it to each and every one. Oh wow, the destructor. Didn't see that coming, eh? It's better already. Blow up everything. Does that have a laser beam? It does have a laser beam. other tank. I got bronze. Keep it up. Yeah, but since this is kind of easy to do and everything, I'll take this time to talk about uh, some other videos. You know, I have a lot of games, but I really don't know what people like to see. I mean, of course, I know that the vast majority of YouTube is into the shooters and whatnot. And I used to be really into them. Uh, I used to be in the game battles for Call of Duty, and I used to do all that try-hard stuff. And if that's something that people would like to see, then of course I will do so. But, uh, you know, if people want to see some RPGs, or they want to see certain games, you know, to try them out, I really am. So, if anyone is watching this and they feel the need that they like me or whatever, then they can leave a comment and t say, Hey, I would like to see you do this video, uh, a video on this game. And I will look into it. And if for some reason this is a million dollars, I'll probably go get it and start a Let's Play on it. The only reason why I would not do a Let's Play on it is if I did not get uh, positive feedback on it. Hey, we got gold. For some reason, it's stuck on the one second marker. I guess because I have a combo going. 
Uh, let's keep it going, because why not? I'm sure I'll lose it in a second. Oh, yep, lost it. Shotgun now. I guess it's just gonna be in a. Oh, we'll go check that out later. Let's just keep it up with story missions. It looks like these hot spots are protected by shield generators. Getting near them will be tricky, but you'll have to shut down each one before you can take out the main hub, which of course is protected by even more sin. So good luck with that. I don't need luck. And what's your hot spot? Actually, let's uh, see if there's a friendly. Oh, there's a friendly fire right there. Think of a giant workstation. A system like the simulation you're in probably requires constant maintenance, which is what these seem to be for. And this is the only one? Of course not. Grab some of these clusters since they're like right in our face. Right. Oh, I can get camo on it now? Let's get full auto. Tentacle bat. Knockback vehicles. Alien rifle. Rapid fire SMG. Alien pistol. Quick shot. And the heavy pistol. Pressing the wrong buttons. Alright. Oh, there we go. Surely not a problem since we can, like, basically fly. Drop off. Keep on running, 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 running. All right, I don't know what happened right there, but. That was a thing. I can't jump up. Well, they're not even going to try to do that cluster. Fuck that cluster. I wonder if they like keep on respawning or something. 
pretty annoying to like have to find all of them. They only have a set amount to just get all of them. Just imagine not having one of them and then having to like scavenge for years. Obviously not years, but generators, otherwise you'll never get to the main console. Yeah, I do. Might as well yank shit out. Yeah, might as well yank shit out. What is with these little red squares? Like in there or something to kill me? I don't know. I don't want to find out either. Oh, you guys have you have a shield. Could be better. Zentech four shield. You got a Zentech four shield. Reinforcements engaged. That's a lot. All right, just try and kill him and knock him over. The last one. Disable alien. Okay. Whoa. I feel like I'm Chris Redfield trying to punch a boulder. Technology. So um, I'm showing some strange readings close to you. What is that supposed to mean? It's right in front of fire. Oh, hey. What is that thing? I don't know, but it is... ...reading like a normal Zen. Thanks. See if you can integrate your code with it. Meaning? It means once you take him down, get close enough, and I think you can absorb him. Right, because I want that. Inside me. Absorb him? What? Is this like... Am I like the Dragonborn, but like the Alienborn? Will I be able to alien shout after this? That was a joke. If, uh, if that seriously happens, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm going Superman, and I just went inside him. Oh, am I gonna be able to, like, be him? Oh, shit. Oh, that is smashing! Hey, it worked! Yes, bravo. Perhaps my wardens underestimated you. I won't let them make the same mistake twice. Uh, that can't be good. Blast them off. Kitsy, set me up with one of those training rooms. I think I can do Elements. Hold on. Oh, wait. Let me see what the weather takes me. Sorted okay. Teleportation. Close. Whoa. Looks like the ability to freeze people and objects within ice blocks. <laughs> Let me load up a few targets from the simulation for you. Oh, hang on, you're not putting in people who will try to kill me. Don't worry, these are safe programs. You can't die from them. Okay. That's right, line up for a whooping. That's pretty cool. Recharge is pretty fast, too. Well, I thought I got the upgrade, but still. 
<laughs> Alright, that's pretty cool. I like that. What? I'll see if I can help with that. Okay, you should be able to recover from being knocked back now. Hold on. It looks like Zinyak added a shield to the warden code. Oh, wow, I can recover from that? How do I get around it? You'll need something more powerful than a weapon. Well, he's kind of dodging. Deactivate the shield for a short time. Then you can shoot him. Cool. See? That works pretty well. It's cool Probably stuff. Probably have to cut this video now because we're hitting at 31 minutes. Let's uh, get our cash on this and whatnot, and then we will end this episode. Oh, man. So like I said, you know, if anyone wants to see any other video games, as long as it, for some reason, at $5 million, of course, I will definitely get it. And, uh, like it, favorite it, tell me you hate it, I'll cry, no big deal. And until then, I'm signing out. Have a great day.